Hi YouTube, this is JJ714 coming at you and I'm doing a quick video and this video really is um I want to thank Boss Gal 3. Um she sent me some gifts um about a couple of weeks maybe almost three weeks ago now. And when I received the gifts, um one of the reasons she sent me them was because I did a video about how I love purple. <laughs> And as you can see, I have purple on. But she, one of the gifts was bracelet. And at the time when I received the gift, I actually could not wear the bracelet. But I have been exercising now. This is my sixth week, um, or the almost the end of my sixth week. And I lost some weight. And I am able to wear the bracelet post now. So here it is. In all its glory. And as you can see, um, it is actually more blue than purple, yet it's beautiful. I love it, and I will be wearing it today, even though I have purple on. Um, I will be wearing it. And um, I have on my purple necklace, and these earrings, um, my daughter purchased those these for me, and they actually... Um, go with this necklace. I purchased this necklace from um, J.C. Penney's about, I guess almost about a month ago now. It may have been three, four weeks ago now. And um, she was out at a festival in um, our community and saw the earrings because she knows I like purple too. And she saw the video that I did and she got these. And so they go just great with um, the necklace. Um, and of course I have my coastal prints on. I have purple eyeshadow on and um, everything. But um, basically that was about um, it, the reason I wanted to do the video. The other thing is, um, as you can see, I am going to be taking my braids down probably tomorrow because I have a lot of new growth and I really wanted to try to see if I could um, keep them in for another week at least and they're not going to make, make it so tomorrow will be um my braid down day and it will probably take me maybe about a uh, couple hours to get it done but um it's not that bad considering that it took nine hours to get them in and i won't be getting braids again um i think what i'm going to do is uh I'm going to wear wigs for the next at least month, you know, um, wearing wigs and exercise and work out well. Um, I'm excited about it partly because I will be able to work with my own natural hair more. But the only thing is I know that I do tend to sweat a lot when I exercise. And um, I'm still sort of, you know, for me, braids always tend to work better. For me, um, with the exercise thing, but um, either way, um, these braids are coming out tomorrow. So, depending on the condition of my hair, I may actually let you see my um, natural hair. I did my BC on the 17th of July, so it's been August, September, October, November, uh, August, I'm sorry, September, October. So it's been 90 days, but. Um, I believe that it, it's grown quite a bit. It grew from the last time I took the brace out, so I'm pretty sure it's grown some more. But um, I will still have to determine if I'm comfortable or not with um, showing my natural hair at this time. The other thing is is that um, my family, we really don't celebrate Halloween. And um, however, my daughter's school is doing something that they call punk a treat. And it's going to be at her school, and um, so my husband is the TPA treasurer, and we're going to be actually um, assisting this evening with that. So we're going to take my daughter and one of her best friends there. But I just want to say for all your parents, and especially single parents, um, you're taking your kids out, or if you're just going out yourself, just really, really be careful because, of course, it's the time of the year that people like to do pranks and different things and sometimes it can get very um, deadly so just really be safe out there watch the surroundings um, be careful with your kids eating candy before they get home 
um, even with people that you may trust. Um, this is just me as a parent. And, you know, I, when I hear some hard aching situations, especially that happen from Halloween, um, it's really, really, you know, gets to me, especially when it comes to our youth. So just really, you know, watch your surroundings. And um, if you get a, you know, like a tension or something, that something just is not right, then it's better to, even if your child is upset about not being able to stop to get candy, you know, stop and buy two or three bags of candy so that they will have the candy, but yet they're safe and you're safe. So with that, I'll say um, talk to you later. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so very much, and have a great day. Bye-bye.